So guys, what happens now if you boot your machine after doing a after doing a an a dis, uh, an upgrade and then it just halts. I can't SSH into this thing. It's just crashed. So what do you do? As you can see here, uh, I hold the power button down, boot it again, and I then can't quite see here, but I, I was just holding down my cursor buttons. I choose Archer Next LTS option, the backup option. So LTS, I think, stands for long term support. And I unlock my hard drive again. And this time it boots. So the the latest kernel was was breaking uh, my boot. 4.15.4 and I even like what do you do like I, I looked at my 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 logs my journal uh, CTL boot and I had a, a look at the previous boot logs and there was just nothing interesting there to tell me what caused the crash logging and Linux stuff just crashes just doesn't seem to work for me so what do you do? I actually made a Reddit uh, post yesterday asking if anyone else had the same problem as I did. So if we can find it, can't actually find it. Oh, here it is. To be honest, I don't think any, well, writing back, yeah, well, I know about that one. See, I'm now on, uh, on LTS. Oh no, you can't see the screen really, can you? On LTS here, so um, the good news is that I did a dis uh, I did an upgrade today. I did an upgrade. I'm now using Yay. I don't want to upgrade these things. To I did an upgrade today, and I know four point fifteen point five uh, doesn't crash. You know, I really I don't know why. I don't know why. I, I, I even not too sure how I even look up. Um, maybe I can on Linux. Git. I won't do that now. But there's there's a difference somewhere between fourteen point fifteen point five point four and point five that fixes it. On my T four six zero S. Still waiting for my T forty eighty. By the way. So um, let's wait until it uh, generates stuff. And I can show you that it does indeed work. And so that's another, that's another issue right there. I'll, I'll link to that other issue down there uh, in, the, in the description. So this is a bit long. So now I don't have to interrupt to boot CTL. And now I go for the standard boot option. And I unencrypt my hard drive. Hopefully you can see my password. Can't see any errors there this time. Wish I could just disable my NVIDIA card here. And now it works. Yoo! So yeah, I'm going to update my, my Reddit. I'm going to try figure out uh, what maybe, oh, sorry what maybe caused this problem in the first place by looking at the git log. Um, but yeah. Archer next life guys, Archer next life. Please like the video, please subscribe. See you guys. And please comment below. That'd be great.